Hello. This video film uh, for reminding you on the things for applying pack and go process. Pack and go process is the process uh, it is needed to apply for collecting all the files, not only the ones created by the user, but also the ones created by the software. Well, have a special folder within the project folder with such a name, package, and then show this folder as the destina destination address. And then, well, apply the process. To be able to apply pack and go process, the file should be the module of assembly, assembly file. After opening the assembly model, the module of an assembly, then bring the cursor onto the file tab, click and then select save as but do not click. Uh, move the cursor to the uh, next pane, over there find pack and go option, with a click select and bring the dialog box into the screen, pack and go process dialog box. Uh, the dialog box may find it is placed in this compact size. Uh, don't forget to click on more tab. This click is for extending the dialog box at the extended part to find one more search button to click. Well, the source file uh, path, the address of the source file, going to be correct if the work or studying has been defined as a project. Destination folder. Well, it may be automatically selected by the software. Well, under the control, your control, clicking on the search button, show in which folder you're going to collect the data, collect all the files. Destination folder. Click on this and then say that you already created a destination folder in the memory of your computer. Well, in this example, the destination folder is in this partition, okay, in this subfolder, with a click next to it is arrow, drop the list of the subfolders in this main folder, okay, within that subfolder, yes, I have one more uh, nested subfolder, open it, okay, and then this is the project folder and within the project folder, yes, this is the folder I specially created it for collecting all the files in this address. If you use such a word in naming the folder package, then it may remind you that it is the destination folder. With a click indicate this and then say OK. After teaching to the software that it is the destination address, then this means you are ready to click on this first search button, search now. This click will um, collect all the solid model files uh, from uh, different places, but mainly the project folder, uh, to where? To the destination folder. The, the, the files found uh, will be listed in this pane. To be able to collect the reference files, uh, for instance, a drawing file is a reference file. It depends a uh, dependent file to solid model. So to collect the reference files, uh, this is to be clicked. Clicked on Search Now tab. And the reference files, dependent files, will be detected and listed in this sub uh, window and then click on Add tab to be able to include the dependent files say for this packaging process and then this means you are ready to click Start button ok, start the gathering if the pack and go process is the one you are repeating after a certain updating then you receive this notice system will say that the following file already exist. Replace it? Yes. If 
the pack and go process is to be repeated after a certain updating yes it is a must answer this question yes yes to all and once more time uh, program uh, will ask your confirmation say yes to all and once more time say program will notice you pack and go file exists in the destination folder shall you overwrite it yes overwrite it and then say okay and the progress bar will appear when the progress bar reach to the end of the strip then done tap will be active for clicking this means you finish that is the thing these are the things to do for collecting all the files about related associated with the model of an assembly okay that's it